Sorry guys, this is a free game that I found through Twitter actually from a small, uh, I think it's a solo indie dev from Aza Game Studios. It's a little horror game. It's supposed to be really cute. And I figured we check it out. My name is Devin DeLovey. The year is 1989. I'm researching the legend of Julia Brown, a voodoo priestess said to have lived in Men Menchak? Louisiana 20 years ago the legend goes she cursed the town she foretold that upon her death she would take the whole town with her shortly after her death three hurricanes hit the area leaving death and destruction behind I will investigate Julia's house to uncover the truth about what happened to her and her husband Charles hmm okay well there you go I've reached the resident of Julia Brown I can't believe it I should check the porch before heading inside Oh god, this movement though. Okay. Um Do we I don't see a flashlight or anything. I'm not Okay. It's a big ass porch. Hello? All right. What? I it I. All right. What was that foot? The footsteps. What was that? Hello. Oh, are those spiders? Oh God. Yeah, yeah. I don't like it. This. Oh, 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 oh. I found something. I have a key. Take it. All right. Let's get the hell from outside. I'm scared. You can't go in there. Got it. All right. Now there's a little heart icon in the. Oh! Screw you, Mr. Owl. Cheese. Cheese. I was about minding my own damn business. Uh, all right. What? What is? What is this? Syringe. Hmm, narcotics at play here? Can't take this object. We'll leave it then. Okay, there's uh, a cigarette. A tr thingy. They were definitely smokers. Yes, I I can see that. Uh, what's this? Julia Journal number one. I keep having the same dream. I dream I'm sitting on my porch. I sing my usual song. I wish everyone in this town will die. The day I pass away, I call upon the spirits of air. I see into the future. All the hate you cast shall come back to you eternally. So mote it be? Or so may it be? Okay. Um. I mean, I don't like neighbors either. So I can feel you, Julia. I wish I had a flashlight. I could really use a flashlight. I don't like the fact that everything is creaking. <laughs> I need a flashlight. Oh god, everything opens. Everything op oh my god. Is there a flashlight? Hello? A campus. Can't take it. Okay. Interact. All right. Could this be Julia Brown and her husband? Potentially. I like this uh, artwork. Oh my god. I. Oh god. Okay. Interact. Is there anything on the back? Uh. Tss. Oh, you can zoom. Oh. Okay. I don't want to interact with this. This is scary. Who is this? The nurse? Or the nurse? Wow. The nun? Uh, okay. Leave it. Interact? Globus. Oh, there's a key! Alright. 
Oh my god, that scared me. The easel scared me. Alright, I like this. I can dig that. I still want a flashlight. That'd be really nice. Oh, can we, um... Oh my god, we can. Okay. Alright, uh... Do... 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 It's locked. Did I not pick up a key? Oh, <gasps> yes! Take it! Oh, thank God. Okay. Oh. Thank goodness. A flashlight. But I, it has batteries. So, yeah. How do you use the key? What is this? Red drawer key? Well, how do... How do you you use it? Um, can you put that away? Do you have to like put your flashlight away to open up drawers? There we go. Okay. What's this? Oh, oh, okay. Death toll of storm placed at 350. Estimated total along Mississippi coast now is 100. Um, okay. Got it. Alright, cool. Um, let's continue this way. Oh no, we can't continue this way. Okay, that's fine too. Uh, yeah. Oh, okay. Okay, don't know what that was, but okay. Whee. Oh, it was a can. What is with all the boogs? Ew, look at all the creepy crawly bugs. And again, ew. Oh, we got batteries. Yo, I will say we use batteries like crazy. Okay. Um... Alright. Tons of flies. Now, in order to... Do you have to, like... Oh, you... Oh, oh. Wait, what? Did it not give me any... Alright. Uh, what's this? Oh, I don't feel comfortable. Oh! What? These damn birds, man. Alright, uh, someone is a painter. Was Julia's husband a painter? Uh, maybe. Uh, potentially. Old oil lamp. Got it. Can we open the drawers? Not these drawers. Got it. Um. Go. Oh! Hey, hey. Uh, stop it. Stop. Can we play the piano? <gasps> Who is knocking? Where did this come from? What? Huh? Where did this rope come from? Alright, I'm not sure how batteries work.
Oh. Okay. Cool. Yeah. I wonder what the symbols on the bat on the book mean. Uh, probably something demonic. Eh. The curse of Julia Brown. Okay. Here's a battery. Can we like? Okay. The person you were trying to dial. Ooh, what's in here? A spell to attract an item to you. Ancient one. Oh, I'm not. I'm not saying that. <laughs> I almost said some incantation. Okay, a human skull. Got it. No big deal. We all keep human skulls in the house from time to time. No big deal. Don't even worry about it. What's this? Julia Journal number four. Wait, how did I jump from one to four? Did I miss some? People keep coming to my house to get charms and healing. I wasn't always this bad person that the locals made me to be. The truth is, the town folks started to take me for granted. So I started to research hexes and curses. I would predict when horrible occurrences would happen to people. My predictions would almost always come true as well. Did I, um... Hold on. How do we... Can we, like, how do you use a, um... Yeah, it does, but it doesn't give you a whole lot of battery life. I'll say that. Alright, I just want to make sure I didn't miss any notes. Cause I oh, wait, what's this? Yeah, this is number two. My husband stays up late every night. I'm starting to think he loves his art more than he loves me. I even put spells around the house for him to notice me, but nothing seems to help. Okay, so that was two. So where was three? Where was note number three? That was four. Alright, well, maybe it's upstairs. <gasps> oh, Jesus. This scared me. This way is blocked. I need to get... I need something to get past here. I need something to get past the eyes. Um... What could possibly help me get past that? A sword? Oh! I I meant the, to grab the, the sword. But apparently I just needed the key. How do I get past it? Closet key. Okay, there's a there's a closet somewhere? That needs this key? I didn't see a closet. Oh! Duh! Oh, that's creepy. What is this, Alice in Wonderland? Oh, hello, monkey? Uh, oh, hold on. Whew. You just got the hell out of me, yo. Julia Journal 7. My husband Charles has spent a lot of time working on an old wreck of a car. We live in Manic Swamp, so a car is dreadfully useless here. The canal surrounding our small community makes most people use small boats. The electricity has been acting up again in our old house. But I will leave it to Charles. He built the house himself back in the day. The voodoo doll on the table serves a specific pur 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 purpose. Uh, a needle is inserted into the heart region. Some folks say it brings love. Some folks say it kills. But what is life without love or without risks? Okay, Julia. I'm gonna need you to just calm down. Oh, 
That's a big old wasp. Okay. Note to myself by Charles. I recently I have recently been on a few fishing trips. I love being away from my wife and enjoy nature. It is an artist wonderland, you could say. Nature in itself is a piece of art. Still, I find myself dwelling on creating the perfect piece. The electricity has been acting up again in our old house here in Manic. Um, I think I left the gas can to this generator in the fishing supply room. The only problem is, I can't seem to remember where I put the key. I think I might have dropped it somewhere in the bathroom. I'll have to go look for, looking for it soon. Not only is electricity acting up, but we seem to be plagued by a damn rat infestation. These goddamn creatures will gnaw through everything. I apologize. I shouldn't use our Lord's name in vain. Remain steadfast, Charles. Remember, Jesus loves you. Okay. Can I, uh, by any chance, grab one of these? Doesn't seem like it. Okay. Oh, what was that? Okay. Um. Mm, oh, mm, see, mm, I would just just leave. That's what I would do. You know what I'm saying? I would just leave. Dinner room door. This is the key that I have. Dinner, dinner room key. Equip. Use. Thank you. Okay. So you gotta equip it and then use it. Oh, hell no. What in the... Okay. Oh, okay. There's a lamp. I wish to make three wishes, please. Um... Yeah. Hello, little baby doll. Um, I'm just, I'm gonna read this note here. My husband Charles and I would rarely have guests for dinner, but when we did, I made sure everything was perfect. I forgot where this brain came from, but it would be the last thing I ate before I died. It tasted particularly sour, with a slight sweetness to it. It reminded me that even in the worst of humanity, we can find some things to cherish. My sweet Charles, how I wish you could paint a picture to illustrate this feeling I'm having now. Okay. Hello, baby. Looks like he's pointing. Okay. Do these pictures mean anything? He's got a note. He's in an electric chair. And he... Is in the dark. Okay. Fishing room door. Oh, he said he dropped it in here somewhere, right? Okay. <gasps> Fuck me. I'm... <sighs> Stop, I'm trying to find a, a thing. A mirror shows us our past, present, and future. Mine is crafted with the finest black obsidian, with a handmade bronze frame. I have spent countless hours looking into the abyss within myself. I am beginning to understand I have a beast within me, a certain urge we all possess, something I must control. In the mirror, I see my future. I see me being alone, finally united with my unborn little boy. I see. So you had, you were pregnant, but then it didn't work out for you. can't crouch or anything so the key is in here somewhere I've I mean like he said that he dropped it somewhere in the bathroom so it must be here somewhere I don't have any uh, Okay. Well, we don't have any more batteries. Hmm, maybe it's not in here. I know in the note he said he dropped it in here. Yeah, 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 hi. Hello? You think normally it'd be in the toilet. What about if I... <sighs> okay. Um, hmm. 
Maybe he lied? Maybe it's not in here? Oh! Wait, were these in here this whole time? Okay, there's an air. That was not here this whole time. Arrows. Is there a key some Oh, you just keep scaring me. Stop. Okay. Why is there an <sighs> Oh. We can we can climb. Um Hmm. Oh my god. Found it. Okay. We're gonna, um, fishing room equip. Okay. Uh, I don't have a flash. Jesus, Sage. Got the gas. Let's go back to the stairs. Oh my god, I'm stuck. Jesus. I don't even know where the stairs are. Oh my god. Oh, they're here. Okay. Jesus, it scared the hell out of me. Oh. Okay. Oh, that's fine. No big deal. Okay. Oh! I watched a scary movie like this once. I don't remember the name of it, but I watched it. Oh my god, I'm terrified. Oh, eyeballs are popping up. Are you like watching me? What? Oh my god. I'm scared. Ew, no. Can I get a battery? Please, I haven't gotten a... Uh-uh, uh-uh, you open that door. Voodoo dolls with the mark of death. These are the voodoo dolls a witchcraft high priest used to put the mark of death on two detectives. Holy shit. Okay. Don't like it. Okay. Is that what's going to happen to me? I'm not reading a wish spell. Uh, sometimes lock myself in the mannequin room. Sometimes I practice turning them alive. Charles has said he saw one of them standing beside our bed late at night. I tell him not to worry. I have them under control. They trust me indefinitely. Right. Right. Nothing could possibly go wrong there. Mm -mm. Not at all. It's jammed. It's locked. I. Did you move? All right, I'm freaking myself out. And I'm gonna, uh... 
<gasps> you do move. <gasps> that one doesn't. But those two do. Jesus. Okay. Uh oh, she Oh, it moves. Oh my god, I don't like it. 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 What are these? For a long time, Charles and I tried everything to have a child. When countless attempts failed, I would blame Charles for it. Even though I knew it was because of my body, I decided to make my own child into a doll. I put a wish spell to turn this doll into a real child. Eventually, he would become alive at night. I loved him, but Charles never could accept him and hated me for what I had done. So you created uh, Chucky. You decided you wanted to create Chucky. Can we not? Oh my god, stop. <gasps> stop! Why are you looking over there angrily? Okay. This is like a... S Oh, I like the design. Alchemy book, perhaps? I could I could see that, yeah. Oh, here's another battery. Okay. Use. Oh, my God. Equip. Mm-hmm. All right, the note. I already read that. Hello, Pinocchio. I'm gonna leave now, okay? Do not try to scare me because that's not nice. I need a key. What key did I pick up? The bedroom key, I'm guessing, is what I picked up. Which is this one? It is. Oh! Mm hmm This is fine. Everything is fine. Uh, my husband Charles believes in his savior, Jesus Christ. I do not believe in religion. I believe it, en it enslaves us into thinking a certain way. I am, however, highly spiritual. I can sense energies all around us. I let Charles put his savior up above our bed. At night, I feel the statue's dead eyes staring at me. Okay. S okay, there's a sleep spell. Now hold on. Do we are we supposed to be like no, okay. Oh my. Oh my. Oh my. Okay. I like the color choices. This is cute. All right, what key do we just pick up? Mannequin drawer key. That was the one. Who the f you weren't there before. All right, I'm here again. All right, mannequin drawer key. No. Equip. Click it. Use. We got another key. 
This time it's the loft key. Alright, don't don't mess with me, okay? I'm just minding my own business. Okay. You equip, select it, use. Cool, yeah. It's easy once you make sure you know the me mechanics. <gasps> oh my god, you scared me. I do not like those. I always keep the loft room door locked. I've been creating my own little world in this place. My healing sessions with visitors also take place here. Hence why the additional beds. I love helping my patients. I would record our sessions through the answering machine on tapes. I would edit them on floppy disks on the old PC. But all of this went horribly wrong on the 8th of De September. Lately, a dark presence has been lurking in the house. I can feel it in the walls, in the air, in my mind. An intruder is lurking in the house. An intruder with the, which the eyes cannot behold. I'm afraid I cannot keep this a secret anymore. I, Julia Brown, murdered my last patient with an axe. I even tried eating his brain in the dinner room afterwards. I tried to clean the bed also, but it was impossible. Do you know how hard it is to get rid of blood? The presence took control of me. Please forgive me, Charles. Please forgive me, everyone. Okay. Oh my god, you scared me. I like how they move and follow you. Mm. Hello? I'm, I'm, I was just trying to read, watch videos. What does it say? Log eight, nine. Log four. Okay, yeah, well, you know, I'd really rather just not deal with that, yeah. Alright, what's this? A battery, yay! Take, take that. Um. Oh, you gotta have the flashlight equipped to put batteries in it. Alright, I'm tearing that off. I'm saving battery life. Hi, sir, or ma'am. All right, now where do we go? Oh. What do we do? Do we need to take the- Oh, do I need to take the axe? Use key. Maybe it's not that. Okay, maybe it's- The kid's gone. Ah, hell yeah, I'm smart. I'm a smart girl. Okay. <gasps> Is this the patient? The locals used to remember me as a beloved local hero, not a revengeful type. To the person that is reading this, this is my last confession. I, Julia, murdered my husband, Charles. I locked him inside his coffin after I killed one of my patients and ate a part of their brain. I could hear Charles gasping for air and yelling for hours. When the silence finally came, I took a final glance at his lifeless body. After this, I went to the tallest tree outside the bathroom window and hung myself. For I knew this evil spirit that has taken over me will, I, will bring me back even more powerful. But on one condition, I can never leave this place unless I destroy it completely. And live unless a living soul discovers my secret. If you're reading this, you're already dead. I'm dead? It says escape the house. Where's the stairs? I can't see. <gasps> oh my god, I'm scared. Ah! How do I get out? How do I get out? How do I get out? Ah! No! Wait, is that how it's supposed to end? Can I get out?
Okay, can't do anything with that. Escape the house. We gotta escape the house. Got it. Get. I'm stuck. I'm stuck. How do you? I did. I did. I did. I did escape the house. What? Did I break it? I think I broke it. Ugh. Um... I think I broke it. <laughs> All right, guys. So that was Perdita. I'll uh, be sure to leave the links down below so you guys can check it out for yourselves if you are interested in doing so. I think it was kind of cool. All right, it's kind of cool. It's a little silly if you're trying to compare it to like a triple A title or something, but it was it was fun to play. It was interesting. I think I broke it at the end, unfortunately, when I tried to see if you could actually escape. Um, so maybe you're not actually supposed to escape. So there's that. But I hope you liked it. If you did, leave a like down below. Maybe in a comment to let me know what you think about it. And I hope to see you guys the next time that I play anything at all. Bye!